Hi guys, I'm Francesca and welcome to the Fusion Beats Dance channel. I'm here to take you through the tutorial of Malung from the movie Doom 3. If you haven't checked it out with the music, I suggest you click here. And what I suggest you do is keep the dance open and keep this tutorial open so that you can learn the steps here with me today and then flip over to me dancing to the routine so you can follow it with the music. I also suggest that you use the hashtag Fusion Beats Dance. So once you start learning the routines and picking it up, do post it online and use that hashtag. So let's get started. Okay, so to get started, we're going to start with the floor routine because the beginning of Malung is quite slow and more contemporary. So it's a really good starting point to do a little bit of a floor routine now. So, to get started, you're using your left leg as the standing leg. Your right leg is going to go out behind and this is where you're going to sit down on the floor. Okay, so it's just going to go out, behind, sit. Now your hands are going the opposite. So they're going to go left, up, right, down. Okay, so left, up, right, down down. So putting that together, you're going out, around, sit on the ground. Now when you sit on the ground, you are sitting on that hip bone. Don't lean back because then you've got no movement to keep going. So you want to sit on that hip bone. Now from there, the second movement, so that takes eight counts, second movement. You're going to come together, so lift your left hand comes back. You're going to bend your knees together. Then you're going to flip over and then you're going to sit low. So you want to keep as low as you can through that whole roll. So if we do it again, you've got left leg is there, right leg is out. Your hand is here because you've just landed. You move it back, bring your feet together, bring them around and sit. Okay. Now that also takes four counts. So you've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then moving to three, four, and then another four counts to get it onto your knees. The next bit, we're going to be windmilling our arms. So what I mean by that is your right arm's going to come forward, back, around, okay? As you do the up and you're going down, the left one is going to swing up, okay? So we'll do that again. So right hand comes forward, up, and then the left hand comes up. So you're sort of leaning on it. Then to come back down, you're going to do the reverse. So the left hand goes down first, while the right hand comes around, and then you sit down. So windmill up, windmill down. That takes four counts. So it's one, two, three, four. And then to finish the last lot of counts for the last lot of four, you're going to lunge forward on your right. So what I mean by that is you're going to take the step and you're going to lean forward in one movement. So from down here, you're going to go forward. As you do that, your left hand is going out and forward. It's flowing shoulder, elbow, wrist, fingers. So how it would look is you're down here. You do windmill, windmill, and then lunge, two, three, four. Now, that's the floor work. So to get up, all you're going to do is use that right leg, pick yourself up, okay? And then we go on with the next bit. All right, so to put it all together again, what we're going to do is we're going to go down, and then when we stand up, I'll do the last little turn, and then we can get started with the next bit. So let's put it all together. Up, around, down we go. Turn, turn, knees on the floor. Then windmill, up, windmill, down. And lunge, two, three, four. Stand up. And then the last little bit, you're going to step behind on the left. And you're going to turn, okay? So you're going to turn to the left. As you're doing that, your hand is doing one of those turns where your hands are flat and they go left to right. So the turn's going to look like step around. No longer on the floor, so we're standing up now. 
Now, actually, when we do that turn, we're actually going to come around to face the wall. Okay, so we're sideways. Now, the movement we're doing with our legs is we're going step together, step together. Okay, so the movement step together, step, and instead of going together that second time, you're going out. Okay, so arms, the arms go out, in, out, out. All right, pushing it together. We'll do that again. We go in one two, out. Now, the music has a little bit of a bop to it. It's a little bit more um, feminine in that movement, a little bit Arabic in the tune. So what we're doing is we're actually moving our bottom half as well. So we're going one and two, three and four. Okay? It can be a little bit fast, so practice it with the music. So one, two, three, four. Okay? After this bit, we're bending our left knee, and as we do that, our elbow comes down. One, two, spiral, sit. Okay? So we'll do that again. So from here, you're going elbow, elbow. Now your left hand is pushing away from your body, and your body rolling up and sitting. Okay? Ready to go backwards a little bit. Okay? So we'll do that again. So we're on the side. We're going one, two, three, and four. Elbow, elbow, under, sit. Now, for the next four counts, you're stepping backwards. So one, two, three, four. As you do that, your hands are going out, 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 like this. So flat hands sticking out, and it's going to the right, 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 right. So from this bit, we push away, and then we sit, and then we go one, two, three, four. And to end the rest of the count, so there's about eight more, we're going one, two, three, four, turn, and then start again. Okay, so we'll put that together, so we're doing it twice. So we're going one, two, three, four, elbow, elbow, under, Sit. One, two, three, four. Arm, arm, arm. Turn. So three of them. Right, left, right. Turn. Go straight into it. One, two, three, four. Elbow, elbow. Duck under. Sit. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then that last one. You don't do a turn. So just end it there. Okay? So have a go at that first bit. And then we come on to the verse. So the first bit, we're pulling away. We're going to be moving to the right, so we're sliding, and then we're sliding, and then we're sliding again. It's only a little bit. Okay? So it's one, two, three. As we do that, our hands are going one, two, and a circle pull. Okay? So we go to the right, go to the left, go out, hit, okay? So let's try it again. So pulling first with the left. So we're going one, two, circle, grab. And you're, and you're letting your fingers go and then it grabs at the end. Then from there, we join our fingers together, okay? So the next lot of counts, we're going kick, kick, one, two, down. Okay? So let's try that again. So we're going to go for the pull. So we've got one, two, three, four, kick, kick, hop, hop, hop. Now that hop, we've used it in another dance before, so do check out the other tutorials. But what you're doing is you're balancing up, twisting it so your knee's up, and then dropping it. But you add a little bit of a jump to it. So jump, jump, down. Okay, so let's try that again. So we've got pull, pull, circle, pull, out, out, hop, hop, hop. Then from there we're doing a cannon. Now if you haven't heard of a cannon before, what that means is that one person goes, the second person goes, third person, or however many people you've got, but they're all doing the same steps, but starting at a different time. So say for instance, it's a simple move like this, 
Okay? Then you have first person does it, second person does it, and so forth. Canons can be a little bit tricky when you've got massive groups, okay? But if you've only got a few, um, I suggest with Malang, splitting your group up into two. So there'll be ones that go first, and then ones that go second. And this movement that we've got, so we're hop, 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 you're going circling, and then hold on to the knee. So first group will go, one, two, down. Second group, one, two, down. Okay, then we want to get back to standing position. One, two, three, four. Okay, so let's do that again. So we've got the pulls. So one, two, grab, hit, kick, kick, hop, hop, cannon. One, two, second group, three, four, spiral, spiral, spiral. So your hands are doing circles. As you do that, your ribs are doing circles and you're stepping along. Okay, so that's the first verse. Second verse, okay. From this position, jump down, okay. As you do that, bring your chest in because you're going down, ha, down, okay. Up and down. So from here, one and two. Spiral your arms, so left hand comes around, right hand, and then meets together. Okay, so let's try that again. Standing together. One and two, spiral and in. Now we're showing our muscles. So take a step out to the right, step out to the left. Okay, all right, so let's try that again. So we've got one and two, spiral, hit, out, out. And this one we did in another routine as well. We did it in Choliki Pichu Remix, and it is drop, drop, and then pick yourself up, and as we do that, we come up together. Okay, so it's drop, drop, pull. And your legs are just going one, two, together. So let's try that bit again. We punch, so one punches down, left hand punches down, right hand up, swap, punch, and then bring it together, up. Okay, so you've got muscle, muscle, drop your body, drop, and up. Okay, now from here, this is where we're doing another body roll. So like at the beginning of the song, we did a body roll, we're doing one of those. So from here, can, first group, roll, sit, second group, roll, sit, and then this time, instead of moving to the front, doing the spiral, move into a line, okay? So as a group, whether you're coming in, whether you're coming out, you're spiraling two, three, four, facing the wall. Okay, so let's do the second verse. So we've just finished the first verse of rolling. We go drop and two, spiral and in. Out, out, drop, drop, up. And first group, one, sit. Group two, drop, sit, and then in a line. One, two, three, four. Now that we're in a line, we're going to separate again. So formation wise, you can actually swap lines this way, or you can just go back to your original positions. But what the movement is, you're keeping your arms with your elbows out. And you're going one, two, okay? As you do that, you're going forward, forward. Now your hip is actually going away from you, okay? So as you're going forward, the hips on the right, then bring it together. Forward, together. Okay? So let's try it again. Now, with this movement, before we step away, we're still in our line, we have to do one more move. Okay? Now, we're pushing away from the person behind us. Now, everyone has to do this at the same time. If not, you may get a bit of collision. So what the step is with your feet is you're going left, right, right, left. Okay? So step back and in, out, in. Your hands push out, push out, push out. So that's the movement. As you go back, you're pushing that way. That's why it's really important that everyone's on the same angle. So what we're doing is we're going one, two, elbow, elbow. One, two, elbow, elbow. And then the chorus. So this is from the actual video clip. 
So what we're doing is we're going to face the front. As we do that, our hand comes over, over, brush, brush, brush. Okay? So we're just brushing our shoulders and rocking. Alright, so let's try that again. So from here, push back and in, elbow, elbow, back and in, elbow, elbow to the front. Right hand, left hand, white, white, white. Then keep your left hand out in the fist. And then you're going up, in, up, in. Okay, so it just rocks, rocks. Okay, just rock it with your hip. Follow it with your hip. All right, we'll do that one more time, and then we'll go on the next bit. So we've got out, in, elbow. Out, in, elbow. Right hand, left hand. White, white, white. Out, in, out, in. Second part of the chorus, two taps, and then scoop your arms. So your arms go out and in, and then out and in. So tap, tap, scoop, scoop. Tap, tap, scoop, scoop. Then we go back to the right hand, over, over, white, 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 and hit, two, three, Four. The main hip you want is to get to the left. Okay? So let's put that together. So you're going tap, tap, out, out. Tap, tap, out, out. Flip right, left, shoulder, 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 and up, two, three, four. And that ends that part. So do practice it. You've got the floor bit. Okay? So at the start of the video, we've got the floor going down to the ground. You've then got the little intro bit. So that is that sort of like an African, African dance of going low, okay? And then you've got the verse, which verse one starts with the pull, and the second verse starts with the drop and pump. The chorus bit actually starts once you get to the line, and you go back. That's the chorus. So what I suggest you do is do click onto the video. So you just want to click here. Do, do it with music, with the rest of us. And also, once you've done it, put it onto Instagram, okay? And use the hashtag FusionBeatsDance. So I'll see you next week for the next tutorial.